I have a confession to make. I really hate going to the doctor. Anybody else? Right? I dreamed of not going to the doctor since I was a kid. My mom, of course, made sure I got there. Okay, imagine this alternative. What if you had a device that could listen in on everything that is happening inside your body? A device that could pick up signals of disease way before symptoms appear. Now let's take it a step further. What if that device lived inside your body? And what if it could reprogram those getting sick messages, telling your body to heal itself instead? keeping you healthy without a doctor visit. This isn't science fiction. This is the future we're already creating at Feinstein through bioelectronic medicine. Using computers and artificial intelligence, we've cracked the code. Deciphering the messages sent between the brain and the body through the vagus nerve running along the neck. Now that we understand the language, we can start sending new healing instructions to the body using electrical stimulation, painless little pulses from a tiny device. It's happening now. By electronic medicine is helping patients heal themselves from inflammatory diseases like rheumatoid arthritis, lupus, and Crohn's disease diseases afflicting hundreds of millions of people. And the possible applications for bioelectronic medicine keep expanding. Christina mentioned her incredible work with postpartum depression. Other Feinstein scientists are looking at using it to stop severe bleeding, be it on the battlefield or in the operating room. And investigators at Feinstein used vagus nerve stimulation to reduce epileptic seizures. Now, as a computer scientist and a neuroscientist, it is so inspiring for me to see how we can use technology to improve people's lives. People like my mom. My mother has Parkinson's disease. Today, drugs are controlling her tremors. But should those drugs stop working, she also has a bioelectronic treatment option, deep brain stimulation. It uses electrodes implanted deep inside the brain to control motor symptoms and restore motor functions, bringing people back to their normal selves. Now Feinstein is taking this to the next level. As we're learning more about neural pathways, we're working to target all forms of bioelectronic stimulation more precisely generating more potent responses, delivering more personalized, effective treatments, which means happier patients living longer, healthier lives. That's what drives us to keep discovering, to better the lives of people that we see fully, not just as patients, but as who they really are, moms and dads, friends, and neighbors, little kids with big dreams. Leading the charge is the man who invented bioelectronic medicine, the man who always inspires us through his brilliance and leadership, constantly pushing us to think differently and innovate. The president of the Feinstein Institutes for Medical Research, Dr. Kevin Tracy. <laughs>